The American Bully was created in the 80s slash 90s in the United States on the basis of the American Staffordshire Terrier and the American Pit Bull Terrier, then supplemented by other breeds of the Bulldog type, such as the American Bulldog, the English Bulldog, or the French Bulldog. The idea to create this breed of dog comes from Dave Wilson and Carlos Barksdale, founders of the world-famous Lion Razor's Edge Pit Bull. Owning a few American Pit Bull Terriers, they invested in some very good bloodlines and bought some of the best dogs of the day, mostly from the Mayfield line, but also some very good dogs from Hemphill. Subsequently, they contacted George Williams, a breeder based in Washington, D.C. They purchased the dog Diablo from him, and this purchase marked the beginning of the Razor's Edge line. Diablo was a rather large and muscular dog who had the size and build they were looking to add to their breeding program. Indeed, Dave Wilson's intention was to create a breed of short, stocky dogs. His line must have had thicker legs and bigger heads than other pit bulls. He also wanted squarer and shorter muzzles. Thus, the line of Razor's Edge was similar to the traditional pit bull, although it was less sporty and lacked the same drive. When in 1997 the pit bull was banned in the county where he resided, Prince George, Maryland, Dave Wilson was forced to leave the region and moved his breeding to Virginia. To perfect his line, he spent a lot of time with other breeders to learn more about breeding and genetics. His vision of the dog he wanted was very clear, he had to have a different face. In 2012, seven generations of pit bulls from the Pure Razor's Edge line had already been created by Dave Wilson's breeding, the Razor's Edge Kennel. Unfortunately, even though he didn't want his dogs to be labeled pit bulls, he couldn't have a pedigree for some of them and had to register them with the United Kennel Club, UKC, the second most large dog club in the United States, after the American Kennel Club, AKC, as pit bull. Dave then began to experiment with many different lines of dogs to finally find the head he wanted. As the different litters progressed, the Razor's Edge line began to look really cohesive. The dog's heads were quite large, but he also wanted the bones to be thicker. So, by mixing dog combinations and bloodlines, Dave finally managed to get the style of pit bull he wanted, called bully style. The dogs were small, with large heads, broad chests, short muzzles, large bones, and short backs, but still within the United Kennel Club, UKC, and American Bully Kennel Club, ABKC, standard. Since July 15, 2013, the American Bully breed has been officially recognized by the United Kennel Club.